Alright, to save you all the boredom of having to watch me play through all that again, I just went real quick, on, went over and killed the first zombie again, and got, went walking back, which only took about five minutes now that I know what the heck is sort of going on. And don't worry, in the spirit of continuity, I sucked against the zombie again! And I am now currently about one hit away from death, thereabouts, there about, because the health system is so vague. So, pick up the handgun, and drag my bleeding ass around this mansion, try and figure out what the heck is going on. First, equip the handgun. Don't examine it. Parabellum rounds. I, I don't give enough of a crap to look up whether parabellum rounds is a thing or not. <laughs> Holy crap, a door that's open! Ooh, shiny. Ooh, ass! Woman drawing water. Okay, I guess I can... Can I go through this door? Egg. Locked. Emblem of a sword. Well, I already know the emblem I've got is freaking useless. I think I tried using it on a sword already. <laughs> so this is where he stores all his useless shit. I'm, I'm surprised this room isn't more full than it is. Yeah, found another knife. whoop de frickin' do Oh. Emergency evade. Alright, now I can cut, stop a zombie from tearing my throat open. And I'm betting it didn't equip... Oh, it did equip it automatically. Never mind. Can I take this vase? Oh. Uh, oh, god damn it. Brains. I wanted the brains of your lady friend, but she didn't have any. Jump him in the knife! Got him! Get the hell away from me, you... Gotcha! Now I'll just pull the knife back out. I said to pull the knife back out. You can't reuse knives, can you? Why can't he just pluck the dagger out of his head, use it again, it's still sharp! Isn't that kind of the point of knives, that you can use them more than once? So I went all the way down here to grab a defensive item that I had absolutely zero use for other than to fight the zombie. I immediately wasted it on the zombie that only appeared because I went to get the dagger in the first place! And also, how many bullets did I use? Well, it was either blow through bullets or get killed because the knife is useless, so. Okay, so that door was a dead end. There's another door back here. And let me guess, the emblem that I have isn't the helmet emblem either. It's not necessary to use this now, of course. These controls suck ass! Oh god, someone's being forced to watch Twilight down there! Oh, I don't care. Nothing down there either. Ooh, another vase. I want to smash it just because I'm pissed. Pitcher. Okay, then. We are not opening the front door again. I fell for that trap once already. Do you open? Oh goody, these open too. I don't care how many times you stop to zoom in on them, the doors are not scary. Oh, another boot. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna run away because I... Because there's actually space to run here. 
That's right, come get your food, come get your food. Come get the fast food, sucker! Ooh, something shiny, but I don't want to go back and get it till the zombie's gone. Why is it necessary to have like seven different camera angles in this one spot? Well, I can push this. I'm guessing I'm supposed to push it over the ledge. Okay. And I have to very carefully work my way back around the statue because these controls are so terrible. Sorry, boob lady. Okay, how far away is the zombie? Don't hear him anymore. Can zombies die of starvation? Like, I don't... I never read World War Z or any of that stuff. Okay, grab the shiny thing. Oh, goody! A dagger! Another completely useless! Okay, I think the zombie is on the other side of the... Oh, goody, he's turning around, so... Oh, yeah, I got plenty of space to run through the door. It's locked! Is this locked, too? Drag it out fast! Emblem of a sword, and I don't have, it's not the emblem I have. What the hell emblem do I have? I can't tell by looking at it what it does. Okay, go back out. Now go back down and investigate where the statue crashed. Okay. Hopefully the zombie does not know how a doorknob works. Or how a door in general works. Or how his legs work. Blue gemstone? Sweet! I found a Chaos Emerald! Only need six more and I can turn into Super Redfield and get the fuck out of here. The graphics actually do look pretty good. I know you can't tell in this video because my PVR that I have does not like Windows Movie Maker, so I have to put it on, the low, on a really low graphic setting, which kind of makes everything look gray. So, sorry about that. I guess it kind of fits for a Halloween horror game. It's locked. An emblem of a sword is on the lock. It's locked. An emblem of the armor. Oh, I haven't tried the armor one yet. See if this opens the armor doors. You are a waste of space! <laughs> it's locked. And that's the door I just came from, so like, so none of the doors up here, the uh, doors are all up here are all no-goes. GO DOWN THE STAIRS! Okay. Why is there a door here? This guy was, I can just imagine the guy who owned this house having an artist, a really famous artist, paint this beautiful mural on his wall and saying, I WANNA PUT A DOOR IN THE MIDDLE OF IT! And the muralist was like, what the fuck? Leads to the in-house cemetery, apparently. I really should not be here on such low health. Let me guess. It's locked. Locked from the other... How do you even get to the other... Whatever. Crumbling tombstone. There's no name or inscription. Buried here is someone we don't give a fuck about, so we're not going to put his name on it. I really should not be out here. Like, I know this is supposed to be a horror game, but I'm more pissed off than scared. I mean, the controls are lousy, the weapons are useless. At least the weapons so far are useless. Tomb engraved with a picture of an angel. Indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. Green arrow must be buried here. I'm, this was built, this says on the box it's the most realistic horror game ever, yet somehow I have not bled out yet. And running around has not traumatized the injury further. Okay, so all the, the two doors I can go through are dead ends. What? Where am I supposed to go? Oh, wait, there, there was that one door back where I started that I couldn't go through because I had to go back and report to Wesker. Maybe I can go. Maybe I'm allowed to go through that now because that's the it's the only place I can go that doesn't lead to rabid dogs that want to tear my throat out and succeed at it. There's the knights impaling each other again. Sh chandeliers. Candle. Not chandeliers. Candelabra. Can I pull one of the swords off of that 
off of the engraving where I got the emblem, because that seems like it might be useful. <laughs> At least have some range to it over the useless-ass hunting knife. It's a very lovely door. Okay. There's a jug there. Please tell me it has something that'll heal me in it. It's got nothing that will heal me in it. At least nothing that's worth mentioning. Why is there a handgun magazine in a birdcage? Seriously. Ooh, nasty. Corpse collapsed on the floor like it was an instant death. Clearly the League of Assassins has been here. Oh, plants. What? You can't carry any more items. I I don't want to carry the herb. You're telling me he doesn't have room anywhere in his pockets for a tiny little plant? You can crumple it up and stuff it anywhere. I don't even want him to put the herb in his bag. I just want him to pluck it out of the pot and stuff it in his mouth. Why can't he do that? There's no room anywhere for a little tiny plant. Fuck. I only, uh, I only have six inventory slots, and I can't drop... Okay, Can I drop the emblem? Because the emblem is fucking useless. I can't drop the... Can't combine, can't combine, can't combine, can't combine. I can't drop an item, and I can't use any of these items right now to get rid of them. I can't make an inventory if there's something else important that I need to pick up. Ugh. <sighs> Fuck. And I'm one hit away from death, and I can't pick up any goddamn HEALING ITEMS! Fuck! Just pluck it out of the pot and eat it, god... Shit. You're dying, for Christ's sake! Most realistic horror game, my ass! Can't figure out how to just pick up something and use it without having to put it in a pocket first. Like he's the most OCD guy, even as he's an inch away from death. God damn it. So, unless I find a place to use the gemstone or I save and waste my other two with my remaining ink ribbons, I can't pick up any goddamn items. So, if there's something else that I need to pick up, I'm just shit out of luck. Can't carry any more items. Yeah, I got that. Can I throw away the hunting knife? The hunting knife is useless. Can I just drop something and then pick it up? No. Even though if you had this situation in real life, that's what you would do. Uh, the creepy music's playing. I'm gonna run into a zombie here, too. Okay, I, I just counted that, that gun is out of bullets. Oh, okay, now I've got items. Okay, now I've got space to go back and grab, grab those herbs. Chris does not reload the gun on his own because he's a dumbass. Instead, you have to manually reload the gun by combining items. Okay, he's... After the, the sixth... The first six bullets didn't make him start bleeding, but the seventh one did, so he's dead now. Okay, now to go heal up. Will you take the green in her? WHAT THE f- And now I can't press into one pocket, you can't make room anywhere, god f Either this game is shit, or this dude is an idiot. I like how he was clutching his gut from having sustained extreme traumatic injuries, but he ate a herb and now he's feeling better. Now he's fine. How does eating a tiny plant, a tiny green plant, make him feel better after getting bitten? I mean, I could understand if it was like a pain reliever, which kind of begs the question, did he smoke it and that, and now he doesn't feel the pain anymore? I'm, I'm not going to question the most realistic horror game ever. Ooh, shiny! Means I can pick it up! Will you take the golden arrow? Yes, I will. 
I'm guessing it's not a weapon. Fuck! And now I have screwed myself in a different way because I'm going to run out of ammo soon and I don't have any space to put more items! Let's examine the arrow, see if it does anything. The arrowhead can be removed, except I don't have space in my inventory to keep both parts of it. Sometimes referred to as a poor man's arm. Oh, oh, uh, the tombstone had a space for an arrowhead. I bet that's where I'm supposed to take it. Get rid of an I. Uh, I wouldn't run back there, but I don't know if I'm supposed to go back there or not, but I want to get rid of this damn arrowhead so I can carry another inventory item because I need more ammo for my gun. No, 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 no. You're still dead? Yep, you're still dead. So we're good. I wonder how much extra time watching every single door open adds to the game because you can't skip that animation. I mean, I guess the multiple camera angles were an attempt to emulate the FMV style of the original game where they just used photos for the backgrounds of the games because they were kind of had to improvise like that for the reduced graphics, but this is a remake. You shouldn't be afraid to fix shit in the remake. I mean, you don't have to make it terrible just to keep in tradition with the original. You fix stuff that didn't work about the original. This better freaking work. It worked! Aha! Now he's got- now Green Arrow has a Kryptonite Arrow for when Superman comes around from the Dark Knight Returns. I didn't want to press why I wanted to- okay, there- there better be something good down here. Stone statue with a hole where the mouth should be. Stone statue with a hole where the nose should be. Stone statue with holes where the eyes, nose, and mouth should be. Stone statue with a hole where the eyes should be. I'm guessing this is a puzzle later. Either that or these four people were being buried, the first three guys gouged out certain parts of their faces, and the, third, and the fourth guy was like, FUCK YOU GUYS, I'M GONNA TOP ALL OF YA! A book is fitted perfectly in the indentation. Will you take the Book of Curse? Do I want to take the Book of Curse, or do I want that I might... No. Screw it. I know where to get it, and there's, this place is unguarded, I'm just gonna come back for it later, because... I have no idea when I'm going to use the damn thing, and I kind of need bullets! Well, that was a big wasted trip for nothing.